Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel again. In this video, I show you how to create a GPO to disable IPv6 on the client computers joining the domain. But before anything, you must know that you cannot configure IPv6 for users from the group policy directly. However, you must download and include the IPv6 template. This template will enable you to include IPv6 settings in the group policy. I will leave you a link to download the IPv6 template in the video description, so that you can download it easily. After downloading the IPv6 template, unzip the folder. The folder contains two files with the extension .dml and .dmetersby. Now copy each file separately and paste it in the path shown in front of you on the screen. After opening the path, copy the file ending with the .dmetersby extension and paste it in this path. After that, open the path that appears in front of you on the screen, then copy the file ending with the .dml extension and paste it in this path. This is the first step to include the IPv6 template. After that, I will create a GPO click on the server manager dashboard. Then click on the tools menu at the top of the page. Then select Group Policy Management. And to create a GPO, right-click on the Group Policy object, and select New. In the New GPO window, enter an appropriate name for this policy, so that you can easily access it later. Then right-click on the GPO, that was just created. Then click at it. This opens the Group Policy Management Editor window. After that, expand the folders from the left side to access the path that appears in front of you on the screen. After opening the path, go to the other side of the available policies and click on IPv6 Configuration Policy. And select the Enabled option, then click on the drop-down menu under IPv6 Configuration and select the option Disable All IPv6 Components until IPv6 is disabled on the cloud. Finally, Click on the Apply button and then OK, and you can close the Group Policy Management Editor window. After that, link the GPO to the organizational unit you want, and you can link it at the domain level. After that, go to or open the client computers, and before anything, do a restart of the client computer, and then you will find that IPv6 has already been disabled on the cloud. I will leave the download links for you in the video description. I hope the video is useful to you. Thank you for watching, and I also hope you subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.